like i worked for over 3 years after my graduation and uh, i was when i was planning for masters i got to know about irma through some of the seniors of irma who were based out of my hometown delhi and uh, then like in the whole process of whatever options that i had the beauty of irma was the on ground learning that i'd heard about and then my area of interest was fmcg more on the consumer behavior side and the fact that irma it's not just about the study of business business management and blah 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 but more on the connection note like the vfs thing it was a big factor internships are everywhere we also have internships but the vfs thing so that was a big point of differentiation like my father was served in the army for 20 years we've been posted in different parts of the country but always in a cant area okay i've been into the northeast side also but cant area okay but never seen the real deal and for me irma was that opportunity in that aspect and when i got it see i'll tell you it's like when you get an opportunity you see what things can be leveraged and worked upon right that's how it irma was for me when i got the opportunity i could see the scope of things that fit in with what i liked and what i loved and that's how i took it up and like that's why when like i still remember in my interview was taken by the professors i'll not take their name so they were asking why and like you worked you had 3 years of work experience in a startup now in masters what are you looking forward to so i did not have a lot of answers there but i just said Sir, all i'm looking for an on ground learning which is very realistic to the things on ground not just books and papers so that is why irma for me like the vfs was a very big feel factor honestly that's like the one thing i understood majorly before joining <laughs> so vfs again 2018 we were posted in valsad okay and uh, we used, we were working with bif and like we would have a day routine and all the activities in the evening we would have this cluster point where all the village folks would be sitting there okay that's where i observed there would be very silent tempos i knew electric tempos were then i asked someone boss what is it so they said bhaiya ye inverter wala gaadi okay yeah so and every evening a person would come in a very fancy car and talk to this cluster of 30 cargo ev kind of drivers rickshaw type of drivers and collect money and go so that's when uh, like my venture builders fc right uh, led by mr pranav chaturvedi he's been a mentor since my grad times okay i wrote to him in 2018 about ki in the world everybody is talking about tesla fancy ev things the bikes and everything but in india it's going ground up the passenger the three wheeler is what happening this is a market of not people who are tech savvy or anything they don't understand like rapid charging or the tech elements they understand the business aspect and they're utilizing it for the sake and i saw it in delhi also like the maximum evs in delhi which we saw were not the cars but the rickshaws passenger rickshaws what i saw in valsad was a passenger rickshaw used for cargo so that's when i just wrote about it, it was an observation and wrote about in like he was my professor this is my mentor something i wrote about it and then when my we finished my masters okay 2020 came lot of things changed i had my placement somewhere i had took some decisions because of the lockdown and health conditions and that's when we took it up as a research project just to understand what is the ev market requirement in our country at the moment focused on delhi right now and that's where the journey for urja bolt started we started searching for a social commerce model for selling batteries because these evs have the battery change in every 6 months the lead acid batteries and right now i'm not saying they are the brands big brands are the luminous excite everybody takes the name but their distribution chain is a concern in terms of the vendors the maintenance the documents required it's tough i had a word like in delhi for this market research you know what i used to do every morning just go to the nearest red light get a passenger rickshaw guy sit with him in the front and tell him to take me to his route that's where i met the owner of the e rickshaw that's where i moved the cluster point that's where i met their charging jugad happening which was a pole with random rod and wire so that's the set of things we were like it's a market with high frequency high the demand is there the supply is also there management is required for that like streamless charging no problems in managing with the officials for the charging you know a lot of things happening so that's where urja bolt evolved in optimizing the battery distribution to begin with and then currently now we are at a phase that we'll be having a whole ecosystem for the ev we are starting ground up with a focus on three wheeler passengers three wheeler cargo and the logic of all of it is to enable that connectivity we'll be utilizing social commerce model in which the existing spaces of existing people in our country will be utilized to create the station space enable their earning which will be like more than just charging but also enabling selling regarding these products 
and also on the pilot side now we are in the logistics side in which we are giving a service of cargo vehicle with a driver at a very competitive rate starting in delhi and this will be starting in next month we are on the pilot phase right now and i'm backed by <coughs> fc venture builders and the starlet group okay this is a public listed company they are backing us up and currently we are doing on the pre seed round so <coughs> see first of all there is no like a, it's like not a formula based situation okay yeah. it's not 1 plus 1 equal to 2 you get a business idea and like i'll just tell you from a perspective of learning at college first of all what happens is there are a lot of people have a lot of drive there are a lot of questions placements coming okay the uh, education loan has to be paid the package is a big concern the location is a big concern and like everybody is on that first day second day when are we getting placed so that is one aspect of thought and then the other aspect is on entrepreneurial side of it entrepreneurial side looks very fancy to hear the objectives achieved but it's like two objectives achieved after 100 tries right so that effort and things are required and to drive that a team is needed a mentorship is needed now as you said talking about venture capital fundraise network i'll i'll break it down first of all leveraging the network that we have you got very senior in my alumni very active now you must be seeing on the social media how active they are talk to them they it's they i'm i'll be telling you like of all the seniors i've talked from prm 4 5 6 7 they really appreciate a conversation and not a random conversation sir like please tell me what to do no this is what i'm doing please tell me your perspective and leverage it they have got a lot of connection we went to young social entrepreneur in singapore we met an irma alam there he's working for intel now okay and he's leading a lot of things at intel linked to ai and social angles okay and then irman is doing that and that's a big wow factor we met him there and like he connected he answered a lot of things for me in that aspect we still in connection there so leverage that kind of a connection or the alumni network now talking about having your business idea how to create a pitch how to take it ahead right it requires some form of structuring i would not say start it straight up learn like first of all all the project works that we get at our college how is it taken as group project not everybody in the group works let's be honest on that and it's like a final last minute submission copy paste tak 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 good you'll get a grade b c d pass hoga fail nahi hoga but what are you learning right at irma when i was working i was i came here after 3 years of work experience for me this was like a big break from a lot of routine things okay for me every class was a scope of learning which i was linking to the work that i had done or seen being done like worked at an mnc worked at a startup right lot of variations there and i for every project work that was given i was very enthusiastic about creating the pitch deck of that project work like the presentation was a big factor for me the wow effect i still have those presentations saved with me we did done consumer behavior analysis we took the live projects okay uh, we did one with big basket also on their app and everything these are all linked to the subjects and the professors were very supportive but the fact is you have to show that drive so for entrepreneurial spirit or anybody first of all this kind of a learning is very important link your learning to current happenings don't learn definitions okay it's not about definitions it's about application and now when talking about very specifically about entrepreneurs taking it ahead your alum network is going to help and once you have the clarity of your business pitch business idea right that's when the conversion happens and in india right now startup support is a big thing i'm very sure on instagram every third day a big post we see new unicorn new unicorn new unicorn now there will be bloody a new term for a super unicorn i'm very sure about it okay things are so now in an environment lot of startups are very eager to hire people if you are not sure about idea you want to understand how startup works go work for a startup understand the kind of pain kind of requirements which are there and then build it up and i'm very sure like i'll give an example uh like now flipkart is a very big name but flipkart supports they are called flipsters okay ones who have a startup after flipkart like uh, cult fit was started by a flipkart person a head there who started his own cult fit and he was supported is called a flipster company support so get that so that's the work experience angle and link up those are very senior people i'm talking about but then again as a young folk also that's a place of learning so but higher risk higher gain wala game hai it's not like comfortable placement you'll have it's not a comfortable routine you'll have you might be working bloody 12 hours a day but that's a learning work there's one kind of a work you can do a clerical work like this is the four set of things three set of people get it done every weekend boss reports sir yes sir nothing bad with that people do that everybody's own choice but if you want that entrepreneurial spirit build up go in a variable side because harder it is more you learn and right now honestly i'll not talk about age and numbers and everything but after masters the 2 3 years experiment learn try as much as you can because this is going to define what you are in the times to come okay 
सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल एक तो दे इज अ परस्पेक्टिव की वॉट द हेल्प वो आर दे टू से नो आई नो माई वर्क द अदर परस्पेक्टिव इज वाओ आई डिड नॉट थिंक अबाउट इट लेट मी फाइन आंसर टू दैट and when you have an answer to that and you can get that kind of a conversion that's your learning that's the spirit you need to have but now honestly it's a tough task like right now in my pre seed stage i have support of afc venture builders in helping me and whatever fund i raise but i'm talking to investors not everybody says very nice okay a lot of people say what are you doing do you know even tech I'm like sir i'm enabling a business tech is a modern operandi of that and i'm very okay with like whatever things come up but this is a scope i have with it but i understand their point and perspective so i know like that's why my starlet group and the battery tech and things we've got sign ups there that's a set of learning so gather those set of learning never take negative feedback as ki oh my god why is not agreeing or she is not agreeing to me take it as what is the answer to this next time anybody asks me this question i should bloody give an answer that they are like wow so take that don't take it as negative take it as a feedback you have to develop yourself on that like always with a smile thank you so much first of all be very thankful to what irma is okay because uh, like <coughs> it's it's been like year and a half i've come back and like when i walk there's a set of memories which bounce up sometimes i'm teary eyed also like thinking about oh we used to do this we used to be sitting here in the mess and doing all that it's one hell of an experience okay you'll realize it after you leave it when we are at erma we find 100 reasons to say what is happening why is it happening okay so be very thankful to that and second thing is like your batch mates right of course you are all competing everybody is running after a package or whatever but in the end just remember you are you have to be there for each other maintain that bond maintain that professionalism angle keep competing yes but in the end we are together because honestly your network is what defines your net worth so yeah build your network